sort of people come here <laughs> to the house party? Cynthia McGinn, are you, are you here with your, your daughter Charlotte? Cynthia, are you around? Ah, yes. Do please come and join me in the main hall at the Grand House. <laughs> Welcome, welcome. Thank you for taking my uh, my offer of you turning up to the house party. Hello, Cynthia. Lovely. Ah, good evening. Do you know why you're here, oh, Cynthia? I do, yes. Yes, you do. Charlotte, do you know why you're here? Yeah. Yes. Why are you here? Because Mum wrote a story about my dog. Sorry? Mum wrote a story about my dog. Yes. That's not why you're here. <laughs> <laughs> She wrote another story to me that goes roughly along the lines of Charlotte spends hours and hours caring for her crowning glory. Her hairstyle costs us a fortune, mostly my own money, says Cynthia. She goes to the hairdressers and then the day later gets out the tongs, diffuser, dryer, etc., and totally changes her hairstyle. I've almost got ringing in my ears during my daughter's visits because the blow dryer is always going. Does this sound like you? <laughs> Not at all. No. no? <laughs> yes. Yes. <sighs> if Charlotte goes away, she often forgets her underwear. Yes. <laughs> You're okay tonight, are you? Yeah. Good. <laughs> but I mean, I could pop you in the money box and prove it. But... <laughs> <laughs> You want to grab a grand? No, we can't do that. So early this year. But uh, she will never forget her vast array of hair appliances. Does this sound like you? Can you tell? Yeah, I think it looks as if you worry about your hair and you look absolutely attractive. But I think Cynthia is right that this can't be allowed to continue. <laughs> This year, but you do, you do recognise it, don't you, Charlotte? Do please step inside. <laughs> I'm sorry you thought you were coming here to support your mother while she did a feature about a dog, but uh, <laughs> if you'd like to sit there, you spent five minutes in makeup. Oh, this will be a lot quicker. Now, <laughs> step inside. now I wouldn't like to think for a moment on this show uh, that we are in any way mean. I'm going to give you 20 seconds to make up your um, own excuse as to why it shouldn't happen, uh, Charlotte. What, what excuse have you got? Everybody at work's watching me. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't think, I don't think that's a... I don't think that's a <laughs> Anything else? Anything else? You've got about uh, three, uh, two, uh, one... Oh, uh, <laughs> Would you like to get uh, next to the uh, box, please, Cynthia? Thank you very much. Well, we had to find a different way of doing it this year. <laughs> Would you like to get uh, next to the uh, box, please, Cynthia? Thank you very much. a different way of doing it this year, didn't <laughs> The house party goes on. We're going to meet the kids in a moment. In fact, we're going to meet Jenny O'Neill in Wait Till I Get You Home. She's putting her parents through absolute murder. Charlotte, thank you for a smile! <laughs>